Okay, I guess I'll go to Castle of Dreams next. I know this is... This one can be a bit lengthy for Vin. Or at least it can feel that way. all the fuss about somebody new in a house somebody never saw a fool never saw a fool oh a new friend where is he in a trap trap down the stairs oh dear i never understood yeah. why vin specifically got made on? small yeah. like that like, that didn't happen to Tara when he uh, just arrived. Somebody tell me how I got so small! <sighs> and didn't Aqua have to get turned small by the fairy godmother or something? But he's just sort of there, small. Don't be afraid. Oh! How interesting. I've never seen a mouse like you before. Mouse? Jack, you better explain this bitch just, to him. This bitch just called him a mouse. That's cl oh my god, that's terrifying. Bow, bow. Look a little guy, make her easy. <laughs> now worry, Bow. Be like a you. Flinda really like a you too. She's a nice, very nice nice. This, this chick can clearly see that is a little human. Come on now. Never seen a mouse like you before. Like, bitch. Hey, my Jack. I'm Ventus. Call me Vin. Sets up in there. Need a set up? Ask that Jack. Vin the runner? Oh well. Time to get to my chores. I'll see you in a little while then. Wow. I guess she's got her hands full. Just work, work, work. Step money. He's replacing really busy Gus. All day. She didn't see I don't remember a whole lot about though. Cinderella, so I don't remember Gus. Oh, no, not so Flinderelli. She worked hard. Got a dream, big dream. Dream done to come true. I don't think I've seen that Cinderella since I was good. very little. Being a keyblade I never cared a whole lot for it. Hey, maybe you can help me find him. His name's Tara. You seen him? Eh, uh, no, no. Never saw Tara before. <laughs> oh, well. It was worth a shot. Come on. Follow me! Gotta see the house! Whoa, man. Hey! Okay, now we're in a little mouse hole. Win! You wanna go? Get him! Oh my god, hit him! Hit the flea! small enough in, in this in this world like in the small version of this world to actually be the size of fleas what's that that's a palace king's palace gonna be a big ball tonight is cinderella going <laughs> I got it. Huh? hello you two have you become friends already Oh, that's wonderful. 
You sure look happy, Cinderella. Hmm. I'm going to the royal ball tonight. <sighs> I guess dreams really do come true. Cinderella! My dress will have to wait. Cinderella! Cinderella! All right, all right. I'm coming. Poor Cinderella. She not go to the ball. Why not? You see, they fix her. Work, work, work. She'll never get a dress done. Say, got an ID. Got an ID. <laughs> With what? Fix up Linda Relly dress for the ball. But what do we need to get? Work around the house. Lots of pretty, pretty things. Okay, let's do it. I'll go find whatever we need. Jock, you get things set up here. Zonza. Rusafi. Rusafi, a cat cat. Mean sneaky. Jump a two, bite a two. Gotcha. Jump a two, bite a two. What? Why does Roxas and Ventus look just alike again? Oh, okay. Well, alright. Well, first of all, spoilers. So, if you don't want to hear this. May want to mute. Um, I'll I'll continue with the I won't continue with the game until I'm done explaining it. That that way, if anyone doesn't want to be spoiled, this um, okay. Okay, so I'm, let me try to explain this the best way I can. Um, okay, so the reason Roxas and Ventus look just alike is because okay, so when Sora turned into a heartless. Back in Kingdom Hearts 1, obviously created nobody being Roxas. Um, Sora, Vin's heart was sleeping inside of Sora at that time. Vin's heart was, was you know, in a deep slumber uh, because of the end events of this game within, within Sora's body, within Sora's heart. Sora turned into a heartless by using, um, I forget, uh, the Seven Hearts Keyblade to stab himself and unlock and free Kyrie's heart. Uh, what he... Now, obviously the nobody that would have been created is Roxas, and nobodies are typically created by the empty shell left behind. Ventus's heart was still in there. Ventus's heart is still was still in Sora's body after that. Sora's body became his nobody, Roxas. So Roxas had Ventus's heart, and that's why he looks like Ventus. Similar to how in Kingdom Hearts 3, they they explain that, you know, you put the heart of... Uh, if you put somebody's heart into a replica or a puppet, a faceless replica or puppet, it'll take the form of the person whose heart that belongs to. Same thing if you put memories into them, it'll take the form of those memories, which is how Shion was made, how Riku replica was made, and, and all that stuff. So, so that's really all it was, was that when Sora became a Heartless, his nobody, his shell that he left behind, his body, still had Vin's sleeping heart, which is why Roxas looks like Ventus. That is also why Roxas can dual wield, because he had Sora's body, being the body of a Keyblade wielder, and Ventus's heart, the heart of another Keyblade wielder. That is why Roxas can dual wield Keyblades. It's also why Sora can dual wield Keyblades because when Roxas rejoined with Sora, Sora got Vin's heart back. Sora getting uh, drive forms simply his Sora's drive forms in Kingdom Hearts 2 unlocked his ability to dual wield. And uh, Tetsuya Nomura had revealed in an interview before that once a Keyblade wielder unlocks the ability to dual wield they just know it regardless of how many hearts or whatever they have inside so but that's that's your explanation so. i didn't see what i was looking for white lace a button i don't i don't remember can i talk to him uh, yeah. huh.
White sash. Okay. White button. Pink fabric. Okay. White lace. Pink thread. Okay. Yeah. Big tap. Jump up on this. Hey, get on it. Yeah. Big step. Yep. God. Oh my God. Get up there. Yeah. Let's roll. Step. Stun edge. I'm on a bed. Yeah. Ain't nothing up here. Yeah. I guess we should go find the stuff. After I save. Back into the mouse hole. Leveled up again. Got a strength increase. Okay. Come on. Start looking for everything that we need. Level up these D links. So good. Chest over here. White lace. Another item down. Three left. White sash. Where the ball go? Hey! What the fuck? Oh, get up there. Yep. 
balloon letter. Yep. Yep. Fleeting crystal. We roll. Yep. Can't reach that. Did I go up here? Huh. Interesting for this to be here and there not be anything up here. Expecting enemies there. Yeah. Okay, I don't know why this is there. Boing. Or not. Boing. Let's go this way first. Vin, even though Terra has slower combos, playing with Vin does kind of make me miss his power. We can do some more fighting. Let's bring out the Aqua D Link again. doing that. Finish! Uh. 
No, sir. Thunder. <laughs> That's such a good combo. Magnet is just so good in this game. I guess I need to go back in here. Yeah. I think. Pretty sure I do. I don't. Okay, which direction did I go before? Jump into fork again. Yeah. I said, jump into fork again. Jump on this fork. Hit the matches. Strike rate. Gotcha. Win. Perfect. Not the cheese down. What, what happens if I just keep hitting the web? Nothing. Okay, I guess I just need to drop down then. Noise. Hey, it's these guys. Hey! Oh, come on. Where y'all going? Yeah! Alright, well that was worthless. For those guys. Oh. Tap. Boy, climb. Is there everything in here? I don't think I can get that, can I? No, there's no way I can get that. Alright. There's a the button. Still needs a pity pity pearl. Pity Leave pity pearl. Me. Okay, so I gotta go back out there. How my command's doing now? Probably meld some things. Do I have any? What was I gonna do? I was gonna do Strike Raid and Blizzard, which gives me Blizzara, and I think I was gonna use a Wealth Ring. Yeah, gives me Air Combo Plus, which I will go ahead and equip. Fire dash with fire screen. I don't like it. Hold on, I need to look though. What gives me? What gives me second chance once more? Okay, I'm gonna need some thunders and fires and stuff because I can get once more off of those. Second chance, I can make with Blizzaga or Curaga or Eraga. Okay. Well, now I know what I need to... what I'm gonna need. I need to level up some more blizzards. Um, I'll add stun edge, I guess? Might as well. Okay. Yeah. 
see if I can buy anything else. Probably buy some fires. Oh, I can buy cure now. Which is good. I'll go ahead and buy two. I'll replace my potions with cure. From level two to level six, not bad. Not bad. Cool. Right, let's get back out there. I'm gonna have um, the, a fight with uh, Lucifer the cat soon. It's like, bruh. Look out! I was just pretend sleeping. Flurry, flurry, bang, bang. It's a fat cat. Cat ready to eat the little human that stole its pearl. That cat's face, like, bro, what the fuck? Take the girl, Jack. I'll hold him off. Run. <laughs> Chase Lucifer off. Dodges, pounces, and leap onto his back. Get up on the Lucifer's back. <laughs> small as a mouse in Lucifer's mind. Apparently, same thing with Cinderella. Light him up! What if one of them came in right now and was like, what the hell is happening to our cat? I didn't know if I could guard that or not. on him now. Wait, how do you get up on his back? Am I just gonna beat him the hard way? Ow! Stupid cat. Missed completely. I don't get. How do you get on his back? Oh, okay. So that's how you do it. Damn it, I hit the wrong button. Sure! Bring it! 
Light him up! Come on! Win! Wow! Yeah! We got this. Learned a diamond dust. That's good because I like I like diamond dust. It's one of the command styles I like the most. Except it tends to whiff pretty bad on aerial enemies. That's so that's not too great. Oh, that's a big thank you. No thanks needed. You saved me before, so I saved you. That's what friends do, right? Now, let's get that dress finished. Like this man know how to sew a dress. Oh well, what's a royal ball? After all, I suppose it would be frightfully dull and boring and completely, completely wonderful. Cinderella! Is that my dress? I don't know how they pulled that off with yeah. the few with the little bit it's of supplies that we us. found, but now you have a dress for the ball. <laughs> <laughs> Vin's well, about it's, it. It's such a surprise. Where I'm the hell is that pearl that I that I had to fight for? Oh, thank you. That shooting star. What if that was? Uh, what if that was Terra landing? Wonder. Being a Keyblade Master is all I've dreamed about. Well, you're not the only one. I know. You, me, and Ven all share the same dream. Funny. I'd never really thought about it. At least until you asked me. My dream is to become a Keyblade Master. Hope a Ven Ven dream come true too. Maybe one day. I just need to keep on believing. I'll be honest. Right? Sora it's... should have been a Keyblade Master by now. By three, of course. But now Yin Sid had to be fucking. He had to be picky with his master material requirements. Stroke of Midnight. Sweet. I love the command board for Castle of Dreams. Awesome. Okay. Save. I'm actually gonna wrap it up a little early and wrap it up there uh, normally I would keep going but like I said though I'm feeling much better um, I'm still not 100% and I'm, I'm feeling a little starting to feel a little off so uh, have you played any of the Union Cross or the game they just shut down I can't remember the name the game they just shut down that is Union Cross um Dark Road is get. Uh, I think Dark Road is getting its last chapter this month. If that's the other game you're thinking of, but yes, I have. I, I played a lot of Union uh, Union Cross. I've been. I've I've gotten my hands on every Kingdom Hearts game at one point or another. I may not have beaten every one like when they came out. Like I don't think I ever actually finished three five eight over two days originally, or recoded. Um. Or even the original Chain of Memories. But I've played all the Kingdom Hearts games. Um, to at least to a point. Um, and all of the ones that are in the HD remixes I have beaten several times. Um, but yes, I played Union Cross. I loved it. I really liked the game. It was probably one of the best mobile games I had, I had ever played. I'm not a big mobile game person. 
it's not it's not really my thing but there are those few that stand out to me and that's one of them is i really like it i would love to see it get like a full remake for like modern consoles and stuff that'd be that'd be awesome it's like on my uh my wish my kingdom hearts wish list um but like i said i'm gonna wrap up because i'm i'm starting to feel a little off i don't maybe it's the, the maybe it's the talking and the focus the energy or something i don't know but is how is ventus in it in union cross because that's his original time. It's complicated. <laughs> it's it's really really complicated. Um, this is this is much harder to explain than the whole Ventus and Roxas looking alike. Actually, um, maybe not. Okay. Uh, spoilers for the end of Union Cross. But um, I'm gonna try I'm gonna try to give a very condensed Cliff Notes version while still having it make as much sense as possible. Um, uh, the time of Union Cross, af which was after the Keyblade War, um, that your player character takes part in, um, new Union leaders um, were uh, were chosen prior to the Keyblade War, so that after the Keyblade War, they could sort of start, you know, rebuilding the Keyblade wielders and stuff like that. Anyways, Ventus was one of them, but not really one of them. It, like I said, it's complicated. Uh, Ventus was there. That's all you need to know. Um, by the end of that story, they take these, these lifeboats, these arcs, from their time that send their hearts into the future. So, that's the best way I can describe or explain it as to why... Ventus lived back then and is also present in this time. He came from that time period, from the time period of the Keyblade War during Union Cross. And there is so much, so much more to it, but I just, I do not have the time nor the energy to try and explain it without writing it down and and, and actually thinking about it. So, um, best thing I can suggest is if you haven't, watch um, a cutscene movie or a, cut, a collection of all the cutscenes from Union Cross on YouTube. Unfortunately, I have not gotten around to doing that one for my YouTube channel yet, though I would like to. But there are plenty of other YouTube channels that have. I think Everglow has done one, and, and it's phenomenal. Um, he did a really good job. You can watch that to catch up on the summary of Union Cross and understand what's going on with the story because Union Cross is going to be very important to the series going forward based on what happens at the end of Kingdom Hearts 3 and the way Union Cross ended it is going to be crucial going forward very important plot information so if you haven't watched those cutscenes I would definitely go watch them um, and I think the app is still out there. I think you can download. I think you can download the app and watch the cutscenes, even though you can't play the game. I, don't quote me on that, but I think that's how it works. I think they still have theater mode in there, and you can just watch all the cutscenes, so that the story is there for you to um, for you to enjoy. And honestly, I hope to record all of the cutscenes at some point and then post them my own uh, little movie on on YouTube as theater mode. Okay, great. You can do that. You can watch all the cutscenes either on YouTube or on the theater mode on the Union Cross app. So, so yeah, it's it's very important. I mean, there's I mean, <laughs> there's a lot I could talk about with the end of Union Cross. A lot of big sort of plot revelations and big plot twists that happened at the end. Um, that that just that blew my mind that blew a lot of people's mind not everybody liked all the plot twists but i thought they were they were wild and wild's what i'm here for i mean why would i play kingdom hearts so much if i wasn't in it for the wild story but anyways thank you guys for hanging out with me if y'all want to talk more about union cross then please you know come visit me hopefully tomorrow night i'll be back on here streaming again 
Um, anyways, if you're watching this on YouTube, please subscribe and hit the like button. It really helps me out a lot. And um, I'll see you guys in the next stream. Y'all have a good night. You stole my heart of gold after my silver.